Hey everybody! So today I wanted to do a video about color combos. What colors look good with each other? I stumbled across this color combination, Plum and Mauve, and I'm sure I must have used that combination at some point before, but when I was playing around with my makeup this weekend I just happened to use a mauve blush with a plum lipstick and I just thought that those two colors looked so pretty together. So today I'm going to show you some examples of those combinations and um, if you've never tried it before, try it. You'll like it. <laughs> um, so today I have on my e.l.f. Studio blush in Mellow Mauve and that's what that looks like. And then I used my Estee Lauder Pure Color Lipstick in Wild Plum. That's what I have on my lips. And that's what that color looks like. But the two together, they just... It's one o'clock. <laughs> they just coordinate with each other so well. They're somewhat in the same color family, but the plum is a more deeper uh, color than the mauve is. But I just love the two together. And it works the other way around, too. I dug out some plum blushes and a mauve lipstick and put those together and that looks really good too. Of course, they're the same colors just in reverse. So here's an Estee Lauder lipstick in mauve mirage. Okay. And this is a MAC blush in dirty plum. And again, you know, those those two colors, they coordinate with each other well and they're similar, but they're just different enough to enhance the beauty of each other. So Mauve Mirage Lipstick and MAC Dirty Plum Blush. He has another example of a plum blush and how it looks with the lipstick. This is Maybelline Dream Bouncy Blush in Plum Wine. And there it is with the Mauve Mirage lipstick. Isn't that pretty? So I just wanted to show you guys that color combination um, in case you haven't tried it together. I think that what you put for a blush really makes a difference in terms of what you're wearing for lipstick because I was looking at a video that I had done. Um, it was a tutorial on the Physician's Formula Quartz Quartet eyeshadow palette. And I like the way the eyeshadow looked with the lipstick that I used that day, which I believe was the lipstick that I'm wearing today. But what I chose for a blush to go with that, it was MAC Dolly Mix, which is sort of a... Uh, Oh boy, how would you describe that color? Um, Dolly Mix is like a glowy reddish pink and it just did not coordinate well with the eyeshadow and the lipstick. If you if you want to see what I'm talking about, go watch that video. Yeah, it was um, Physician's Formula Quartz Quartet tutorial. And it just, to me, looking at it, you know, in hindsight, um, it just sort of ruined the whole thing for me because, and I didn't really see it at the time, I, I think I must have known something was off about it, but I couldn't quite put my finger on what was wrong. And that blush just does not look good with that lipstick. It just threw the whole thing off. So it really does matter what you use with a blush and lipstick together and uh, can just throw off your whole look. So that is my first color combo video, and I do I did also want to mention, speaking of plum things, that I finally got around to using my OPI Eight Berries in the Canaries nail polish, and this is a good one, you guys. This is a one coater. I did use a base coat under it. Um, right now, my base coat of choice is Stuck on You by Color Club, but. I, so I just did a base coat so that, you know, I didn't want to take a chance that this could stain my nails that color. And just one coat of this, 
and I've got full opacity. So this is a good one. I mean, how often do you get pretty color, nice formula, and a one coater? I mean, that just saves time all the way around because obviously it saves time because you don't have to sit there and wait for multiple coats to dry, but also when you remove the polish, it's a lot easier because there's less layers. <laughs> So uh, that's my first color combos video. If I come across any other combinations in the future that I think coordinate well together, then that's what you'll see, you know, color combos and then the two colors that I think look well together. So I hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.